right, guys, you know what time it is. It's time for Kitties Militaria. Sorry for the absence over Christmas. The uh, wife and I decided to take a trip to Europe. It was a great time. We went to a number of different countries and uh, had a really good time. So with that and the kitty's approval, we'll dive into it. Today we're looking at the 511th Slavna Brigade or 511th Famous Brigade. The 511th Famous Mountain Brigade was formed on September 1st, 1992 as the 111th Bosnian Krupa Infantry Brigade in the town of Pistalina near Bosna, Bosanska Krupa with the aim of defending free territories from aggressors. Let's see, the brigade operated as part of the 5th Corps of the Army of Bosnia and Herzegovina. During its existence, the brigade never had a problem with the number of personnel, but the main problem of this brigade, as well as the entire army of the Republic of Bosnia and Herzegovina, was the lack of weapons and military equipment. And despite that, their contribution to the war was extremely significant. On September 1st, 1992, the brigade consisted of a command with support units, three infantry battalions and support units, a mixed artillery mortar battery, 120 millimeters, a mixed anti-tank platoon, and a mixed LARV PZO with a total of 1,692 fighters and elders. By order of the General Staff of the Republic of Bosnia and Herzegovina from April 1st, 1993, the brigade was renamed the 511th Mountain Brigade. Izmet Mujanovic was appointed as the first commander of the brigade, and Ilyas Osmanagic was the chief of staff and deputy commander of the brigade. The second commander of the brigade was Fadil Hasanagic, and after his departure of, to 5th Corps, Saki Butkovic came to head the 511th Mountain Brigade for a short time. And then after a little more than two months, by order of the 5th Corps command, Mirsad Sernkic was in command from September 14, 1993 until June 13, 1994, when he was killed in the Podorovo region of the battlefield. After him, Mursad Sedic came to the position of commander from the position of deputy commander of the 5th Corps, under whose command the 511th achieved its greatest victories, which resulted in the liberation of Bosanska Krupa, on September 17, 1995, a few months after the liberation, Alia Kurtovic came to head the brigade and he was the last wartime commander of the 511th. After the signing of the peace agreement, Husanya Avadgic had the honor of being the last commander of this celebrated unit. On December 14th of the same year, by the decision of the presidency of the Republic of Bosnia and Herzegovina, the brigade was awarded the honorary title famous, while 47 elders and fighters of the brigade were awarded the highest award, the Golden Lily, and three fighters were awarded the Silver Shield. All right, guys, that'll do it for the book work. Let's take a look at what our amigo here is wearing. So I got this recently. I really love this. It's almost like a corduroy type uh, fabric, really, really thick also. I've got the pants that go with this, so uh, it came with a full set. So taking a look at the patch, he's got the 511th Famous Mountain Brigade patch. And he's got his DDR M5676 painted helmet. He's wearing some good old U.S. Army uh, LBE, a load-bearing harness. And taking a look over here, this is something new that we got recently also. Really nice fourth core flag with the tasseled fringe. This is epic. Love that. Take a close up of this patch. Really like those early patches, man. The silk screening on them was just awesome. The artwork is great. And over here we'll take a look at the RB, huh? patch all right guys this was just kind of a simple one to uh, break back into making the videos again apologize for the absence I hope each and every one of you had a great holiday and with that we hope to see you back again soon